a detective? <laughs> Craving a grimly satisfying reminder of your own stupidity? <laughs> then test your mind against the brand new Riddles and Stags Airships, the malicious hideout, and the abandoned film studios. Stags Airship, the malicious hideout, and the abandoned film studios. Every riddle has been placed. My master plan is in effect. My master plan. Forget all those other pretenders. Remember who your real nemesis is. Nemesis. Well, hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Batman Arkham Knight. Looks like the Riddler has placed some more riddles for us to find. So at the end of the last episode, uh, we basically completed the story, the main story of this game. And now our uh, mission, our remaining mission here, is to... Let's see. Isn't this how I select a mission? Yeah. Um... We need to apprehend six of Gotham's most wanted to activate the Nightfall Protocol. And I did a little bit of research online. And apparently, you have to activate this Nightfall Protocol in order to get one of the endings to the game. So, I'm going to do this so that we can finish the game and that we can see the ending. Uh, so, yeah, let's see. We need to do six. And I guess... What is this thing telling me here? This is telling me that I guess we've done we've got a hundred percent of two of them, and let's see. This is this. Oh, we've got hundred percent of three of them. We also did this one right here. Okay, um, and then the next closest one that we've completed would be this bat. This man bat mutation. We need to locate man bat and administer the cure. The problem is, I don't think. I can track and hunt the bat creature by listening for its distinct echolocation delivery. It must be stopped. Now, I know that we had heard it at one point near this uh, shopping mall, um, but heck if I know where that shopping mall is, I have no idea. Um, and I'm going to guess that this is not marked on my map anywhere. Um, a bunch of other stuff's marked on my map, though. Is this it? No, this is just a militia thing. Um, hmm. Filter. Filter, objectives, riddles, AR challenges, and militia. That's it. Objectives. Let's see. Does this show up as an objective anywhere? It's kind of looking like it doesn't. Unfortunately, there's a question mark here. Oh, that's the next Riddler trial location. These are... Oh, okay. Hmm. So, this man bat, we're just going to have to hear it. You know? And, um... I don't know, man. Locate man bat and administer the cure. Yeah. Hmm. Well, we'll just keep an ear out for him, I guess. I guess that's really all we could do. Uh, so we'll have to pick a different mission. And the next mission that's almost finished, the next closest one is this one right here. Let's see if this will show up on our Lazlo map anywhere. Valentine. He's killed six people, Alfred, but no more. It's time to pay a visit to his beauty parlor. Okay, so we're Be supposed careful, to go sir, to this beauty parlor. Yeah, he is... Um, we are supposed to investigate Pretty Doll's parlor. That's what we're supposed to do. Laszlo Valentine. He's killed six people, Alfred, but no more. It's time to pay a visit to his beauty parlor. Be careful, sir. The man is unhinged, even by Gotham's standards. Um... Hmm. Well, I thought I would have something to... Do I have my utility belt back? Am I going to be able to... L latch on to anything? I'm going to guess that the Joker is gone now. We're not going to see the Joker anymore. So... Yeah, I don't know how interesting this is going to be. Running around taking care of these missions. But, um... Yeah, I mean, if we want to finish the game, that's what we're going to have to do. All right, is this gonna get, thing gonna give me anything to latch onto? Hey, look what's up there! It's uh this this dude. Oh, I don't think I could get up there. This um Azrael dude. Why why am I not getting anything to latch onto? Here we go. Okay. 
Well, we're here. We might as well uh, do this. I'm not too excited about this. Um, because this is just going to be another one of those fights. Um, the last one was ridiculous. Lady of stands for justice and protection. The right place for Azrael's last test. So this will be his the last test. Safety is at stake, sir. Make your decision wisely. So the last, the last time we did this, he had to fight off all these guys, and he wasn't even allowed to get hit. So I can't even imagine what ridiculousness they have for us this time. But we'll give it a shot. I am ready to face your final challenge. It's the toughest yet. Mm-hmm. I'm sure it is. Oh boy, here we go. Okay, ninjas. So we got ninjas here. Ouch. Oh, sure enough, he hit me, and that's the end of that. Only a worthy successor can complete the challenge and avoid getting hit. <laughs> Give me a freaking break. You can do better than this. Oh, he hit me. Oh man, I thought I pressed the right button. Well, oh, crap. Me. Ready yourself. Go. Holy crap. That took me 20 minutes. <laughs> that was ridiculous. You are to be commended, Azrael. You have passed the test. I will contact you when I have made my decision. There is no decision to make, Batman. I am ready now. I decide how this works, not you. Every moment you waste, Gotham falls deeper into the abyss. Make your decision fast, or she will be lost forever. Sir, we have a positive ID on Azrael. His real name is Michael Lane. He was a GCPD officer before he was dismissed due to psychological issues. And then, well, he seems to have disappeared off the face of the earth. That must have been when he was recruited by the Order of saint Dumas. It gets decidedly more peculiar, sir. The bad computer has picked up an irregularity in Lane's physiology. I've not seen anything like this before. Upload the data to the clock tower. I can analyze it from there. Right you are, sir. Hmm. Interesting. So are we supposed to go to the clock tower now? Is that what we do? Analyze Ezreal's unusual neurological activity at the clock tower. Well, let's go ahead and do that. Why not? Clock tower's right there. Um, unfortunately, I don't have anything to... Um, grapple onto, so we're just going to have to run and hope we make it there. Yeah, that was, uh, that was ridiculous. Ridiculously hard. What? Is this guy still talking Why, to me? Hello there, oh, him. Bruce Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> A noble effort, Batman, but did you really believe that I, the Riddler, would fall for such a nakedly impossible parade? You expect me to accept that I've invested time and agonizing time again by some spoiled trust fund fueled hobbyist? I don't believe it. Why, I, I, I refuse to believe it. It's not true. It's true. Well, I'm afraid it is well, true, Riddler. Where were we? we? I don't know. Where were we? I'm getting ready to go in the clock tower. I don't know what you're getting ready to do. Um, I still don't know what the empty reminder is. I have not been able to figure that one out. I keep looking for something, something empty. Um, and there's all kinds of empty things here. There's an empty jewelry box there. I've scanned that. Um, let's see. You know, there's her empty little closet there. I've scanned that. Um, 
There are, let's see, I mean, there's all kinds of empty things in here, so I don't really know what the hell he's talking about. And frankly, it's pretty annoying. Um, so, I don't know. I, I can't imagine ever figuring out all of those Riddler riddles. Okay. Let us use the computer. I'm sending over the data on Michael Lane now. I'm no neurologist, sir, but I can quite confidently assert that doesn't look like it belongs in one's brain. It's a surgically implanted microprocessor interfacing with the temporal lobe, the region of the brain used for storing and accessing memories. Which memories, sir? Visualizing now. Azrael, protector of faith, defender of purity. The Order of San Dumas has safeguarded Gotham for over 500 years. And it is your sworn duty to continue our legacy. You have studied the Dark Knight for years, learning his every strategy, analyzing his every tactic, perfecting his every move. Now it is time to complete your mission. Seek out the Batman. Prove that you are his worthy and trusted successor. Only when you have won the Batman's trust will you be able to fulfill your destiny. His intentions do seem pure, sir. Are you suggesting these recollections have been tampered with? I am. Alfred, I know this symbol from Arkham City. It's the Order's sacred language. They've implanted markers into Lane's memories to modify his behavior unconsciously. If I can find the other markers, I'll be able to reconstruct the waveform and reveal the message. Yeah, that makes sense. The hell am I doing? What's going on here? What's going on? Uh. What am I doing here? Is this right? Am I doing this right? Well, is this the right thing to do? What am I doing? What the hell am I supposed to be doing here? So I can go through this whole basically minute long thing by rotating the right stick, but that's kind of tedious. Ooh, that was scary. What am I doing? I don't understand what I'm doing here. I have to look carefully. The markers are here, hidden in the memories. So I'm looking for markers? What's going on now? Like this thing? Nothing in this area. I need to scan the markers in order to reconstruct the waveform. Scanning that marker has reconstructed part of the waveform. It's working. Oh, brother. So I'm looking for those things, I guess. So we get to slowly work our way through this video looking for little triangles, basically. So now I have to go backwards because I'm at the end. So let's keep a keen eye out here. If you guys see something, point it out. So there's one. Haven't we come across another one yet? I'm hoping they'll be easy to see, but um, is this one? Another portion of the waveform has been restored. Okay. So maybe there's gonna be one per scene. Maybe there's one. This is idiotic. Almost there. There's probably one more marker to find and scan. Okay. Uh -huh. Anybody see it? Oh, this? That's it. The waveform is complete. Okay. This should reveal the message. All right. The Dark Knight's 
stands in the way of our cause. He prevents the evil of Gotham from facing true divine justice. When you have proven yourself, wait for your moment and then strike him down. Take your rightful place as Gotham's new guardian. A guardian wholly willing and relentless in his quest to protect this city. They certainly don't mince their words, do they, Master Bruce? How will you stop him? He won't. Oh! Lane. Lane is dead. I am Azrael, knight to the Order of San Dumas. The Order has lied to you, stolen your free will. Liar! You stand in the way of true justice! We're on the same side, Michael. No. No! I know who I am. I know what I am doing. In that case, the choice is yours. Protector of faith. You know what must be done. What? Oh, now I'm controlling him. The choice is yours. What, I get to make the choice? Whoa. Well, why in the world would I make him attack Batman? I am Batman. What the hell? The Dark Knight must be slain. Ooh, neat. Or what? What are my choices here? None of the buttons do anything. And I do mean none of them, except for that one. Oh, I could zoom in on stuff. Um, well, so what if I don't want to slay him? What if I'm like, all right, Batman, you've convinced me. You're right. Um, what? Do I not have any other choice here? I don't want to slay the Batman. Fine, I'll grab. calls to you, Azrael. It's one true master. Okay. Oh, hide it behind your back so Batman doesn't see you. What the? He stands in your way. Oh, there we go. Gotham will be yours. Well, gosh, I think I'm going to break the sword. I thought myself the instrument of God, not the tool of man. You're a tool, all right. Oh, okay, now what? <laughs> Batman's like, whatever, dude, just get out of here. I've had enough of your crap. Leave, clock tower. Goodbye. You made the right decision, Michael. I do no one's bidding but God's. The Order must answer for what they have done to me. Yeah, you go get them, Azrael. You go get them. You show them that you're, well, not a tool. Mission complete. Three more upgrade points earned. Character bio unlocked. Let's look at his character bio. His real name is Michael Lane. He was a police officer in Gotham City. His first appearance was in Azrael Death's Dark Knight number one, March 2009. I find that interesting. Years ago, Michael Lane was part of a program to create the ultimate crime fighter. Instead, it turned him into an insane criminal. Thwarted by Batman, Michael confessed his sins to a priest of the sec secret religious sect, the Order of Saint Dumas. They recruited Michael to fight evil as their crusader, Azrael, wearing the mystical suit of sorrows and wielding the sword of sin. In Arkham City, Azrael prophesied Batman's downfall. Batman? <laughs> Batman's downfall. Having studied the Dark Knight's fighting style, Azrael sees himself as the caped crusader's natural successor. Uh, let's see. The suit of sorrows bestows enhanced strength, stamina, and speed. Where could I get one of those? The Sword of Sin burns with the souls of the damned. You can keep that. Prone to fits of insanity, military, and police-trained tactician. 
Cool. Oh, wow. These are new. Thomas and Martha Wayne. Well, he was a physician. She was a philanthropist, philanthropist I guess. Um, wow. Detective Comics number 33, December or November 1939. Wow. Heir to the Wayne family fortune, Thomas Wayne also inherited the family's sense of duty towards the city of Gotham. Unlike earlier Waynes, however, Thomas was adamant in pursuit of a career of his own working as a surgeon at Gotham General Hospital. Martha Wayne, I don't even know how to say that, knee, nay, cane, administered the Wayne family charities and foundations in his stead, spearheading campaigns to solve Gotham's homelessness and poverty problems. Their joint murder behind Gotham's Monarch Theater shocked Gotham, scarred the young Bruce Wayne, and would eventually lead to the formation of his Batman identity. Oh, vast wealth and strong sense of civic duty. Here we have Red Hood. Real name Jason Todd. He's a vigilante. Wow, he was in Batman number 635 in 2005. Huh, I'm well gone. Since vanquishing the Arkham Knight persona, Todd was able to lay his vengeance against Batman to rest and begin to heal the damage that was inflicted on him in the asylum. It was during this recovery that Red Hood was born. How can he see out of that thing? Now, while he is once again aligned with his former mentor in wanting to rid Gotham of his, its criminal contingent, Todd's willingness to kill will forever keep them at odds. He's an expert marksman. Uh, he's a martial arts master. He's driven by justice, and he's willing to kill his enemies, which is kind of refreshing. Let's face it. And then over here, we've got Vicki Vale, for some reason. She's an investigative journalist. She's been around since Batman of number 49, back in 1948. Investigative reporter Vicki Vale got her start at the Gotham City Gazette, where she quickly rose to fame due to her unwavering commitment to rooting out the ugly truths behind Gotham's corruption and poverty. After her frontline news reporting style almost led to her becoming a direct victim of Hugo Strange and the Arkham City Conspiracy, Vale was relentless in bringing all living conspirators in the scheme to justice. Undaunted by her near-death experience, Vale remains fearlessly dedicated to her work and committed to the people of Gotham. She has hard-nosed reporting skills. She's Gotham's most trusted name in news. She's fearless and a skilled interviewer. Okay, well, there's a couple more that we haven't unlocked yet, but we'll get to them. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Character Showcase unlocked, Ezreal. 